Hi everyone, Cheeky Tan here and my husband Tim. Hi everyone. Today, thanks to Brian, we're going to be doing a UK taste test. So let's have a look at what's in the pack. Oh, it smells very herbal in here, don't you think? Oh, it smells like tea or something. Oh, oh. Let's start a UK taste test. Oh, there's a note. Hello, Cheeky Tam and Tim. Hope you are both well. Sorry to hear about your dad, Tim. Oh, thanks, Aww. Brian. Here's some more stuff from the UK. Hope you enjoy. Brian, thank you, Brian. Brian has sent us <laughs> 700 teas. How do you feel about this? I can't do that many teas in one taste test, unfortunately. Let's try this one first, and it is mint toffees and these are made by walkers in natural mint flavoring i really like the drawing on the front of it it's got some dude running with a kite and a dog after a walker's truck but i don't know why he's running it down to get the toffees yeah but if he was going to put the full effort in let go of the kite dude while she blabbers on about kites and that we'll do a taste test <laughs> they're individually wrapped okay there you go can you see that yeah mm. oh. Mm, mm, mm. I really like the Walker's toffees. They're really mm. rich and creamy. Mm -hmm. And stick to your teeth. And they have a nice sort of flavour of mint coming through. Mm. Do you like the mint in the toffee? I do. Not overpowering. The toffee's really creamy. Very nice. <laughs> I almost choked and died. Next up we're going to try these and they're cookies. Cadbury oh. Crunchy Melts. And they've got a chocolate centre in them. You can actually put them in the microwave for 10 seconds so they go all melty. Oh yeah. Oh. I don't know if I'd like that. No? Why? Because no. I don't like melted biscuits. They'll probably be melted when you open mm. them because it's like 40 degrees today. But it says it's even better warm. Oh. I'm going to melt mine. Whoa, they are so big. Look at that. Wow. Mmm. You're going to break it in half, are you, and show them the middle? I'm going to go down and melt mine, so Lots I'm just going to leave you chocolate. with chocolate. How long Tim, do you have to cook it for? 10 seconds. I'm going to leave you with Tim for a second. Behave yourself with him. At least 10 seconds. Yeah, I'll be back. It's quite crunchy, very flavoursome cookie. The chocolate's not hard, it's just like a, a creamy filling. I don't think it needs to be heated up. I think it'll just get all gluggy if it gets heated up. But yeah, I really like these, Brian. Maybe you are supposed to melt them, but I don't think you need to. Mmm, yum. I like that the biscuit's crunchy. I think if you put it in the microwave, they'll just go soggy. I'll leave this half attempt to try. You sell my natural at this, can't you? <laughs> what are you doing up here? Okay, let's open it up to see if it's melty. Oh, look at that. See, it's a little bit melty inside. Well, it did stay crunchy. Mm. I said I wouldn't stay crunchy. I have to try half of yours now. You can have half of mine. Mmm, look at that. How long did you put it in for? 10, 10 seconds? seconds? I like that it's got the melty chocolate inside. That's a really cool idea because it sort do of too. feels a little bit home bakey sort of feel to it. I just thought when you microwave this would go all doughy or the biscuit part, no. but it hasn't. The cookie itself is quite sweet and then it's got the choc chips as well and then it's got the oozing chocolate in the middle so it's a little bit over the top but I like it. Did you try one that's not heated? Yeah, no, Don't that is like good. Okay. Definitely put them in the microwave, I've got that's a good on idea. My face like temp. No. Do you want to have a tea? I do actually. I'm going to have the three ginger because you can't have ginger. And I'm going to try. Ah! Oh! This one appeals to me. This is vanilla chai. Hooker? Pucker? Hooker? Isn't that the little warthog in Lion King? No, that's Pumba. <laughs> My one's just three ginger, warming blend of ginger, galangal, and galangal. golden turmeric. Mine's a caffeine free lift flushed with cinnamon. Oh, cinnamon more. Not that, Tim. You smell See, mine. That, that's a tea bag, guys. I got you some boiling water. Thank you. I've got a handle on things. <laughs> what colour do you reckon go orange? Alright. Isn't this a lovely couple's thing to do? Mine's the same colour as yours. Yeah, it's not doing much at all, is it? Maybe we have to let it seep for a while. Seep? Steep. Steep? Step. <laughs> oh, I thought I dropped that in. I think that's it for mine. I think that's it for mine. Can do you I want have a bit little of water? bit of water, please? Yeah. Cheers, everyone. Oh, it's too hot. Just tastes like hot water to me. <laughs> oh, I've got it. I can taste mainly in this one cinnamon. Do you put milk in chai? I think no. you do. No. No. You sure? Yeah, yuck. I reckon you would. I reckon yeah, you could. Yeah, I'm sure. Yuck, you don't. <laughs> you know what rhymes with chai? Die. <laughs> It's not good. It's not good at all. I can't believe you're drinking it. I just feel sorry for it. Way too much cinnamon in this one. Barely any vanilla. Ugh. He's given us actually two licorice yeah, and two, cinnamon. Yeah, two, so we could have them two together. Two peppermint yeah. and licorice. We haven't followed that rule. We've got sorry, ice cream in. Do you want to have a sip on mine? Mine's really not very nice. 
Oh, yuck. You should have said don't have it. I did tell you. What is chai? I have had chai before, but it hasn't been so strongly flavoured with cinnamon. Very Too much. Do you like the ginger one? No, it may... <sighs> Yeah, it makes my mouth tingle actually. I don't mind the ginger one. Mm. Just like nothing, isn't it? It's like hot water essentially that's gotten a look I've never really ginger. gotten into herbal teas, you know. Um, I'd rather just have a normal black tea. I'm gradually doing these tastes I've gradually gotten used to having herbal teas and some of them I don't mind. So we're going to try another couple of herbal teas now. How many herbal teas do we have left? Two, three, Four. Four. Okay, so I reckon that we should try two more each. Licorice and cinnamon. Who wants to try that? Not me. Okay, I'll do that one. No, you won't like that though, sweetie. Oh, how's that smell? It doesn't smell too bad. Really? It smells like cinnamon. Where's the jug? Just using this, are we? Yes, we are. It's not going to go far. I'm going to try night time. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's sort of a greeny colour. It's so like a wee colour. Yes, Mine's thanks. Mine's more for like that. a tea colour. Cheers. I don't mind the nighttime wine. I think it's alright. I can see myself getting into this just before bed. It's got a chamomile taste to it. Mm. Mine has it? a cinnamon taste, but it's very mild. It doesn't say there's chamomile in here. So can I have a swap? Can you taste licorice? No. And my one has a dreamy blend of oat flour, lavender, and lime flour. What's an oat flour? Tastes yeah. chamomile to me. I'll swap you. Try, try. Oh yeah, cinnamon's the main taste yeah, of that, see, isn't it? Yeah, see, the cinnamon's killing it for me. I can't taste the licorice. I like this one, Tam. Yeah, that one's nice. This one, not so much. It's okay. The cinnamon just overpowers everything, though. Mm. Hot. This one is three mint flavour. What are the three mints? You're probably dying to know. Peppermint, spearmint and field mint. I've never had a field mint. I don't know what field mint is. Mint you pick from the field. And I'm going to have a peppermint and licorice. Oh, that looks lovely and green. He's just pouring it in the cup, by the way. Here you go. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I don't know why they put licorice on it, they just should call it peppermint. Really? Can't taste licorice Not in it? that much. You know what I think about this one? One too many mints in there. Really? Yeah. The field mint overstored yeah. it. <laughs> There's white mint in there that I'm not a fan of. Well, you wouldn't think peppermint and spearmint would go together either. Uh, I swear there is a mint in here that is making my tongue go numb. Do you want to have some try? <laughs> yeah, you have a try mine, it might refresh your palate. Yeah, I can't taste licorice. It's just like a dulled down mint, but I don't mind this one. Peppermint. It's quite nice. Holy jeez, that's hot. I disagree. Mm. It's not one mint over another. It's sort of really balanced. Do so you think it's one too many in there? I feel like there's three of them fighting for first place, and then there's one that ultimately wins and sends your tongue numb. And that's why it's field mint, because people don't usually get it. It's in the field. It's probably poisonous. <laughs> Where do I go with that? <laughs> That's my review. Well, look, I don't mind this one. It's quite nice and refreshing. McVitie's oh. Club Orange Chocolate. I don't know if this is just really, really broken or if they come in separate bra bras. <laughs> separate oh, no, bras. no, look, it says eight on there. Hello. Eight. Because most things have a tear here, but this does not. Oh, jeez. That's all right. I know what I'm doing. Ooh. Cute! Thank you. Cute! Nice. I really like the way this is packaged. This reminds me of chocolates, how they used to pack them. Dairy Milk used to do their chocolates like this. Let's open it up. Oh, it says club on it! How exciting is that? I love it. You should. Oh, orangey. Have a look in the middle there. Oh, it's like a little biscuit. It's a biscuit, an orange. Mm. Oh. Mm. Mm, that's nice. So it's a biscuit with a little layer of orange on top of the biscuit and then it's coated in chocolate. The chocolate, really nice. Mm. Oh, that's delicious. Mm, mm. Instant finger melt. Worth mm -hmm. it. That's really good. Double dip chocolate toppies. And these are from Walkers as well? They are from Walkers. Oh. Have a look in there. Oh, what's going on? What is it? Have this one. There's nothing in it. Oh, there's another one with nothing in it. Double. What's going on? What the Walkers, you owe us two chocolates. <laughs> they're actually sealed and they're empty. <laughs> wow. Let's have a look. Eee, look at that. It's very nice. Next cause is double chocolate, double dip. Double, double your dip. odds or nothing. Okay. Mm. 
got the caramel in the middle of a chocolate. Very That's nice. That's yum. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. It's nicer than the first one. The chocolate's really good. The caramel in the middle is really nice and creamy and smooth. Really sweet and delicious. Mm. Mm. And it's very soft. I yeah. like those, Brian. Thank you. They're kind I'm of like the reverse of a chocolate eclair. There's a piece of chocolate in here. Yeah. No, that's mm. weird, isn't it? You don't eat it. You don't know what's happened with it. It might have been on the factory mm. floor and now it's here with you. Gives you an idea of how it's made. They obviously make a little chocolate cup and they put a blob of caramel inside that. Then they double dip it with the chocolate, chocolate on the outside. McFighty's Club Mint. This comes in eight bar packs as well. It's going be dark chocolate, won't it, if it's club? <gasps> Look at these gorgeous little bars. They're so cute. Okay, so I'm assuming it'll look similar to the other one and have club on the front. It's a milk chocolate. All right. Whoa! It's a very similar setup to the other one. It's got a biscuit and then some sort of a cream filling as well. Mm. That's nice. Mm. Very nice. Mm, mm, mm. Lovely fresh pop of mint flavor in there. The chocolate's really nice and creamy and smooth. And then you've got that crunchy sweet biscuit in yeah. there. Yum, very nice. Very nice. Look how hot it is, you could so oh, melted. <laughs> it's so hot here, it's ridiculous. Thank you so much for watching everyone and thank you so much to Brian for sending us all of these amazing treats. And thank you Brian for your kind wishes regarding my dad. It has been a hard time. Have a fantastic week everyone, we'll see you next time. Bye. Au revoir. Seems like we're into minty goodness because we've got some more. No, we've tried that. <laughs> I've put it in my hand just to show you. Well, I've put it on so I can see it. No, if I try to turn it around, it's not going to work.